Mr. Kiran, congratulations yes, on securing All India Rank 68 in Mechanical Branch in GATE 2023 exam. Thank you, sir. Uh, Kiran, you tell us uh, what type of coaching that you have availed from our AS Academy for your GATE preparation. Yes, sir. I was an AS online uh, course student, sir. So I joined in uh, last February batch. So you online joined online. in our AS Academy online live online class. Live class. Live, yes, yes. Online sir. live classes program. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Okay. Kiran? Yeah, uh, yes, sir. Before you go further, can you please introduce briefly about yourself along with your college details? Okay, okay, sir. So uh, I am Kiran. Uh, so I am uh, coming from Kerala. So I have uh, done my graduation in mechanical engineering uh, from Government Engineering College, Trishu, uh in 2021. So after that, I have uh, worked uh, for a core company for around seven to eight months. But after that, I have decided uh, to prepare for GATE uh, fully so then i resigned from there and uh, uh, started my full de full dedication on to this uh, gate journey okay uh, kiran uh, will you please elaborate yes. how this es academy online live classes helped you in your gate preparation and securing this rank all india rank 68 in your gate exam uh, yes sir uh, ace the, the classes in ace was like uh, it was like in very depth the classes were taken so since I had time, it was always you know, easy for me to learn from the very basics. So every teachers in this institute uh, taught me from the very basics. So uh, you know, as a very basic student, it's, it's very easy for you to learn and then uh, apply that concept to higher levels. So, and also the books were also very good. In a workbook was there, bits and bytes. So, no, it was all in a systematic manner and uh, classes were also organized in that way. And uh, even uh, teachers were also very friendly. They were ready to help you at any moment of time. So you know, it was like in a systematic manner, everything went on well. So during that one year, uh, it was easy for me to cope up with the studies. And then at the last uh, two, three months, I went on to the uh, mock test and then uh, revision, uh, all those things. Good, Kiran. Kiran, you attended a uh, yes online live classes. Suppose yes, if sir. you missed any class, yes, then what you used to do? Uh, normally, I try to uh, be ready for the live classes. But uh, if some uh, issues occurs, I'll uh, I have the recording three times. You can watch that recording. So yes, I think it was easy for me to cope up uh, with the uh, next class. Yes, Academy provided facility. If yeah, any student yeah, misses. Session. If anyone misses the classes of this online live classes, he will be provided what you call recorded a class of the class. Yes, and you can and also PDF of, PDF of the notes also. Yes, sir. That you can use for your revision purpose also if you revision want. Revision purpose also. Yes, yes. So you found it useful? Yes, sir, I found it is useful because you know, sometimes you it is a chance that you can miss the class. So you have option to watch it three times. And also during the revision time also sometimes if you find some topics difficult you can again revisit that uh, uh, topics okay and one more thing while attending this live classes did you prepare the notes simultaneously uh, most of the classes i uh, written along with it but uh, sometimes uh, in some classes and all like figures and all other things were there so i had that pdf with me uh, which is uh, uploaded in the portal so uh, that was also available for me. So like simultaneously, I had managed things, uh, but apart mainly from, I have written the notes. Okay. And apart from this, uh, attending the classes, preparing the class notes yourself, did you prepare anything uh, additionally, the short notes for a revision purpose? Ah, yes, sir. Uh, every, every time I have, uh, I had the notes and uh, I had prepared, I think like uh, two or three short notes. Uh, Know, as as the time progresses so initially i had a, uh, a, a short notes on concepts formula and it was like little bit larger one uh, but in the last moment of time especially during the mock test uh, you you will not have much time to read those things so i had very small formula book was there so which was also prepared from the notes so i, I used to read that uh, in the last moment of time so that was also uh, helpful for me so what you used to do to improve this 
uh, numerical problem solving uh, uh, abilities and then time management and accuracy required for the gate examination uh, i think sir the, the main answer is the mock test itself sir uh, because you know uh, you can understand where you stand in your mock test so uh, initially i i, I used to get uh, uh, an average only but uh, i try to improve along the uh, course of time so in the mock test you will be able to understand like how much time you have in your exam it's like a replica of your original exam itself so uh, if you are uh, doing some 10 to 15 mock test i think it will be very easy for you to understand that uh, uh, nature of exam how it happens and uh, for improving your uh, numericals i would suggest that the textbooks that ace is providing even workbooks are there uh, then bits and bytes is a very a wonderful book i i really recommend to all of you people because conceptually that book is very uh, strong because only if you are uh, conceptually strong you will be able to solve that uh, book so uh, if you are uh, solving all those things you will have a confidence that you will be able to uh, score good so from that uh, uh, you, you can improve your calculation and numerical skills uh, in your subject okay is it necessary to refer to any test book for this preparation additionally uh, no sir i i really uh, didn't uh, refer to the textbook much because in as i said earlier ace is taking the class in a very depth manner so most of the uh, all the faculties are referring to lots of textbooks they are saying uh, and uh, we can understand from the notes it's a very large notebook so in a, and if you have some doubt i would say you can recommend but mostly uh, I, I don't think there is a much need for the textbook, sir. Uh, every other resources provided is much necessary. Okay. And uh, in the case of the uh, gate examination, we have to use a virtual calculator. Ah, so yes, how do you improve your uh, practice on this uh, virtual calculator? Uh, yes, uh, in the online test series platform itself, you have sectional tests there. And you have subject-wise tests. So in, in all these things, you have virtual calculator. So you know I, I've been practicing on subject-wise tests in these virtual calculators. And then uh, during my last uh, one or two months, I have uh, used my laptop or like virtual calculators there, try to solve problems. So initially it was difficult, but uh, I, you know as you practice more, it is uh, quite comfortable after that. So, like, even the test series itself, you will be able to master it. So, what was your strategy with regard to the preparation in the last one week before the gate examination? Uh, uh, last one week, I, I completed all the mock tests. There was about 15 mock tests were there for us. So, before one week, I have completed my test series. And uh, I have uh, uh, marked the important questions or the questions which I didn't get. The concepts and formulas and uh, some of the tough formulas that you can find in your text notebook also i, I tried to uh, mark that thing in, in my uh, test series feedback book is there so i tried to uh, revise that uh, test series book uh, during my last week and also the uh, small short notes also and uh, and it's it's more over like a mental strategy you need to have it's like not a very lengthy uh, preparation you, you can have but uh, it's, it's more of like you can have a little bit relaxed strategy but it's all about revision sir in the last one week your revision so what strategy did you follow on the day of gate examination in the examination hall uh, <clears throat> as i uh, done the mock test i found that like uh, many people including me uh, they'll have a chance of like directly jumping into the question maybe may be a little twisted but uh, you, you will jump on to that uh, answer uh, after just seeing that question so what i did was that i made my mind sure that i'll only answer uh, after completely reading that question uh, in, in very detailed manner so only then you can understand that if there is some twist in that or if there is something more that it requires so uh, and and also simple ones i i, I started earlier and I kept the tough ones for the last section. And uh, so that like you will have that confidence to write the tough ones in the last section. So 
and uh, in in a slow and patient manner i i read the questions properly and then uh, to avoid the mistakes so i think that will that would have helped me in the exam so for your 68 rank how many marks did you score in this gate examination uh, i scored a 71 marks sorry 70 70 71 71 sir 71 marks okay yes, 71 marks oh, what is the gate score now uh, 835 835 okay. right right okay mr karan so from this successful preparation and having secured rank of 68 can you please share a few tips or suggestions to the with the other aspirants of the gate examination particularly in the mechanical branch uh you know uh, from my experience i i understood that like gate uh, is like changing uh, from every year now they are like looking more on to the conceptual background so uh, it is not uh, you know no not necessary for you to remember all the formulas you know they are not trying to make you mug up all the formulas so the changes are seen so it's like you need to learn the things conceptually and um, moreover practice is required in, in every field itself so practicing more mock tests and uh, learning from your mistakes every time and uh, there are chances of demotivations every time if you are uh, writing the mock test itself so but but you should uh, rise from every, every time you should rise up and uh, you, you should have a hope for the uh, future that like you can do better every time so if you have that hope and determination i, I really think and if you follow the strategy systematically uh, gate is not a very tough examination you can easily crack it okay okay giran thank you thank, thank you for you. joining and uh, sharing your preparation tips with us and i wish you good luck in your all future endeavors yes sir thank you thank you, you please convey our best wishes to your parents and friends also okay god bless you giran okay thank you sir thank you